workers has not sufficient uh, money and they need to survive with their family. And as I told earlier, because uh, garment workers have two uh, uh, family, one in urban, another is a rural. So if they have fam parents, they need to support them. If they have children, they need to support also. Uh, so they, they have triple kind of uh, burden. So what, how much they earn is not sufficient. So they have no choice for the surviving. So may, many say, they said, we want overtime. We need to extra income. So it's a manipulation, it's a exploitation, but workers do voluntarily because they need it. If I'm going to the brand, they have to keep fair price and fair wages because we need living wages. We need freedom of association. We need collective bargaining. We need rest. We need education. And health is important. Shelter, recreation, savings, social protection. So these kind of things need to be improved. So that is why the fair price and fair wages is important. And the women are not cheap labor, women are not slave. That kind of mentality and attitude also need to be changed from the global supply chain. And the fair price, fair business, ethical business practice is important if we want to really change. Because if you are pushing only the Bangladesh government and supplier, it will not happen. The European government, the UK government, the American government, they all are responsible because profit is goes to their country and they are giving aid to us. They are, we are begging. So we don't want the aid. We don't want the charity. We want our fundamental basic rights.